it doesn't mean so much for the economy because um, over time the regulators have not really come in to regulate the environment, the Bitcoin environment. So the monies that you see, the 250 million that you're seeing, were done by individuals and exchanges um, transacting within each other. So um, really, there's not a court, um, there's no significant court going to the CBN uh, uh, unless um, you have an environment that is a lot more regulated. That's the only, that's the only way that can have a significant impact on, on the economy. But what's more interesting about that um, chart is that if you look at the, the, um, the list, you find that um, countries like US, countries like um, um, Europe, um, China, Japan, all of them came up um, last year, despite the fact that the market was very, very um, down. I think we we'll look at the question from the fact, uh, from the point of view of what makes people put money in Bitcoin or any other cryptocurrency. What actually ha happens is that when an economy is facing some challenges, or when you have currency um, devaluation looming, or maybe, for instance, the China and U.S. trade wars, that's the reason why you find on the local Bitcoin um, chart, um, U.S investors in Bitcoin have increased their stakes in Bitcoin. Chinese investors have also increased their stakes in Bitcoin. That's also why you find countries like Russia, okay? That's also why you find countries like um, um, Venezuela, okay? And in Nigeria, that's also what is happening. If you have, if you have uh, issues, okay, look at um, um, the last inflation uh, points that were released. Nigeria's inflation has gone up. So definitely there's going to be, there's a, a lot of unstable environments around the Nigerian economy. This makes um, traders afraid and that's the reason why you're, you're probably going to see more people use Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies to make transactions abroad when they want to make anything and all. So it, 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 that's definitely going to happen. When you have a, a high political um, candidate uh, making comments around cryptocurrencies uh, uh, in favor of the market. Um, however, you, you have to ask yourself, um, what's the um, mentality of the people around him? Because he's not going to um, be Nigerian president in isolation. Atiku has, has to have a finance minister and other people surrounding him and, and all. So how long that statement in, in, his, uh, in his agenda is going to take, we don't know. But um, I, I feel there's, there's going to be a lot more positive um, vibes coming from the government if he, if he becomes the president of Nigeria. Like I said before, it's a very positive um, development. What what's going to happen, uh, or what we're likely to see, is that from that statement, you you, you begin to see um, uh, an intensity in 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 the effort to bring out um, a regulation. Okay, so a regulatory policy, uh, and also it is going to engender that to happen. Uh, so it, it means that in SCBN. Okay, it's going to work towards bringing out the regulation for, for the market. It also means that when people um, look at Bitcoin, they look at it from a positive um, view. They are not going to just uh, think it's uh, an MMM or something else, you know. So it is something really positive for the market and it's going to help people um, build their trust um, and also increase adoption in the market. Again, it's not going to be in the short term. It's also going to be a long term because I am aware about an ETF um, going on. E ETF is uh, essentially trying to bring um, cryptocurrencies uh, into the futures market. So if that happens, um, it, it somehow will translate um, to um, the, the stock markets as well. So you're going to find a lot more um, Bitcoin exchanges maybe wanting to go to the stock market to raise funds. So it, that's Definitely there's going to be a lot more transparency, okay? That's what it's going to engender. So I, I, I think it's a very, very positive uh, um, development.